This is a night. This is the night I was created for. I'm gonna put on my best disguise and go knocking on everybody's door. This is a night. This is the night I'm gonna hit the street. <laughs> We do a little bit of trolling. We do a little. Trolling. <laughs> We partake in a little bit of tomfoolery. <laughs> Where do I even begin? You know, I'm not really the type of person that makes videos about hit tweets on Twitter. You know, like, OMG, a hit tweet. This doing numbers. But you know what? I trolled the internet pretty darn good. And. I gotta say, Troll was successful. Um, we, like, other YouTubers are talking about it. Freaking Omni thought it was real. Here's a clip of it. My boy Chefback said, uh, I'll mention this again, but Garfield was released in Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl as a free DLC character. And yeah, if you guys don't know Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl, the, the Smash Killer that ended up not being the Smash Killer. <laughs> uh, yeah, they came up with a new character. It's, uh, it's Garfield. And uh, they were basically hinting towards it. The uh, funny and unique thing about this character Garfield is the fact that apparently you cannot play him on Mondays. He's actually unplayable in the game. And if you, it's very canon to the actual comic itself because he says that he hates Mondays. So Garfield hates Mondays so much that he decides not to actually to enter the game on an actual Monday. Imagine being a Garfield main and you have to do a tournament on a Monday. That'd be fun. <laughs> so... For context of what this is all about, uh, yesterday, or was it day before? I don't know. Either way, the other day, I had made a tweet, um, but it was a fake tweet. So it was structured like an IGN article, and this is it right here on screen, I'll, I'll show it to you. I said, holy crap, Garfield is unplayable on Mondays. And the article right here is it's made to like an IGN article well I mean it is an IGN article and I just basically doctored it to where it says Garfield is unplayable on Mondays and you know what it's like 99 it's I would say it's a good 90% believable looking back and forth that this, you know because I actually put some care into making this edit and the funniest part is that I made it on my phone while I was on my break at work because I was thinking you know It'll be funny if Gar Garfield wasn't playable on Mondays, and that's what I did. I took, I took, here's the original IGN article, by the way. And what I did to make it was, I did a side-by-side -side comparison, and all I did was basically, uh, take bits of the original article and sprinkle it in with, uh, my own little flair. <laughs> uh, but, long story short, it just says stuff like, you know, developer, uh, and also, by the way, um, uh, one big giveaway that this article is fake is I misspelled Ludosity, or is it Ludo City? I feel like I'm having the Hydrosity, Hydro City, Metrocity, Metro City problem. Jeez Louise. Either way, I'm gonna call them Ludosity. I don't care if I'm wrong or I'm right. I think Ludosity sounds cool. But people that paid attention noticed, yeah, the spelling was kind of off, but overall, this blew up. Everyone thought it was official. Everyone started sharing it around. Multiple verified accounts and news journalists were saying, wow, this is amazing attention to detail. This is awesome. The freaking, the actual creator, <laughs> he actually noticed it. He was like, big if true. And oh boy, yeah, it, it wasn't real. And I was actually, you know what? What's really funny is that instead of milking the uh, tweet and the joke too long, I immediately said right underneath of it that it was fake. I said, uh, I'm gonna confess my sins. I'm sorry, IGN. Uh, but, you know, patching a buff, maybe? And also, um, since I never get the attention I deserve for this one meme, I did make this Garfield meme that everyone shares around. And by make, I mean I added that caption, and it's a fake caption. It was never true. Everything you know and love is a lie. But yeah, I will add, just looking at these quote tweets, it's just funny seeing so many people that genuinely believe this. I even got freaking Fidel on here. <laughs> he, he got me. He got me. He quoted me, and I was not spared from his wrath. He got me. He he, he genuinely thought it was real, and then he set back, then he found out it was a fake. And you know, it would have been one of the best Easter eggs in the game. But yeah, I'm sorry, guys. It's it's a fake. And uh, do you know what? I'm just gonna enjoy 
I'm just gonna enjoy the maximum trollage I have performed. <laughs> and that's basically where I ended it. Um, I made a pretty hit tweet. It got, at the moment of this video, uh, a little over 7,000 retweets, close to 40,000 likes. I mean, come on. Everyone loves this and it's hilarious because it's still trolling people. Shortly after I made that tweet, I made a follow-up tweet. They're saying, trolling successful, proceeding to next target, and oh my god, <laughs> would I purposefully spread misinformation over the internet? <laughs> and I just show a screen cap here of how I edit it on my phone using this uh, cheap phone editor I paid for a while ago. But yeah, that pretty much sums it up for this video. I performed a successful troll, and I'm overall happy with the results. Overall, trolling successful. Moving on.